today I want to talk about um, a very new um, paradigm that is introduced to programming language world, which is the concept-oriented programming. Basically, we have been studying for so long about the object-oriented programming and the whole idea of objectifying every component, everything that we see in our world. But when you actually look at things from a methodological point of view, from a conceptual point of view, you'll find out that there are things that cannot be objectified, like love, hatred, soul, a lot of other things that we have in our minds that are ideas. These ideas, when they are collectively gathered together, they may guide some objects to reality, to the seen world, but they will never be objects by themselves. Therefore, some scientists, computer scientists, came out with a whole new idea called the concept-oriented programming. And it's based on the idea that every object could or should have a reference. So before we were on the object-oriented programming, we were basing all our, all our programming were based on a class. It's going to be based on the concept. So the concept of things is the beginning of each and every action and object in this world. If you look back in time, you'll find out that the before the object-oriented programming paradigm, people used to base every function and every method based on action. And then they found out that these actions are coming from objects like a human being. For example, me, I eat. So the eating came from the object, but I came from a soul, which is the concept. So the concept generates the object, and the object generates the method. And that's how it should be. I invite everyone to understand very well that we shouldn't get stuck with one paradigm in all our life or careers. You have to study and think more because programming is nothing but simulating this whole universe that we live in and try to find a perfect solutions for most of the problems that we have. Programming is just a mathematical, practical thing of just a way more practical way of introducing mathematics to the world. And mathematics is nothing but solving pro problems as the language of the universe. So. Go ahead, learn about concept-oriented programming, try to apply it to whatever programming language you use, and good luck.